I wonder how many of us remember our preschool days. And I wonder if the main character in the story after the break, little Sam, will remember his preschool days. Cheeky doesn't feel that he needs help. Not from Sam, anyway. Besides, part of his survival program is never to trust a human. Every mongoose knows that. Preschool education is much written and spoken about nowadays. For three-year-old Sam to Tetsi, daily life with his dad, who works in an animal sanctuary, is spent amongst types of animals that most kids of his age only hear about from storybooks. Sam's day usually begins with a routine game drive. On Falyapi, the sanctuary's tractor. Most of the animals in the sanctuary roam free. But some choose to stay close to the homestead. It's their home, really, as much as Sam's, because they're orphan animals. This is Oz, or rather, Mother Oz. Sam knows when to keep a distance. <laughs> Sam's dad says Mother Oz is best approached from the front. And these, these are the pigs. Sam knows that they know that a good scratch keeps the peace. Besides, who else can pick ticks off better than Sam? These are Sam's friends. His human friends. They ride the farm roads together after school. But when they're gone, it's back to the sanctuary and the orphans. They are Sam's animal friends. is an orphaned mongoose, and he's not afraid of snakes. In fact, he's not afraid of much. Ask Odds. Watch out, Oz. Watch it, Cheeky. Oz can kick. Run, Oz. Cheeky can bite. Ah, uh, that's Tess. She's new around here. Caught in a felt fire, she was, escaped but by the skin of her shell. It's Sam's job to wash her wound. She's improving every day. It'll be a sad day when one day she walks back into the felt, never to return. But that's what happens around here. Animals come and they go. And when they go, Sam knows not to be too sad. Besides, he'll probably see them from the tractor someday. But Cheeky? Well, he's kind of a special friend at the moment. Sort of a flavor of the month. One day, he'll be off too. Remember, he's not afraid of anything. His biggest challenge is really to learn how to feed himself in the felt, because he was born in a city. He's on a kind of a special mongoose survival course. Sam doesn't really know what mongooses eat, but he knows that these holes made by the pigs are a great help. Cheeky doesn't feel that he needs help. Not from Sam, anyway. Besides, part of his survival program is never to trust a human. Every mongoose knows that. It's no use complaining to Dad about Cheeky. Dad knows about orphaned animals. He always says that it's safest with the ducks. What can a bird do, anyway? The ducks are ever grateful for their daily ration. Mmm, greedy ducks. They always overstay their welcome at the sanctuary. This is dream time for Sam. Oops, mistake. It's never dream time at this sanctuary. What was that we said about birds being the safe option? 
One tends to forget orphan animals are really wild animals. Their best option is to run free as soon as they can. Sam knows that he'll see them again from the safety of his dad's old trusty Fully RP tractor.